Right. <clears throat> Let's do some sharing. Sharing is caring. Uh, where's the link? Go. Let's do a short stream of the frogs guide uh, before the Think Games. Tweet the same thing. For the at thinky underscore game stream. Gothic Lords, how's it going? Happy Saturday. I was just sending out some tweets. You've been getting through some of the demos, right? From the Puzzle Fest. I've been seeing that. I'm, I'm jealous. I wish I had <laughs> uh, a moment to check out the stuff that was, that was in the Puzzle Fest. What's the, what's the best demo so far? music quite enough? I feel like the music was quite loud so I had to turn my volumes down. Um, let's get started. So this is a frog's guide to eating flies, a game by David Simon, presumably not the same David Simon that made The Wire. <laughs> that would be <laughs> quite a surprise if so. Press space. So I have played this before. I think I've played all of it. Viewfinder is the cleanest Christmas new mechanic so far. Yeah, I mean, Viewfinder was definitely gonna end up being good, I think. Like it, like it, I get a sense that people are concerned that it might not go super deep with its mechanics, but then, eh, I think it wants to be like a kind of little showcase of what it's doing rather than something that people get stuck on or something with really deep challenges. Okay, we're gonna eat some flies. I got a tongue that sticks out in space. I saw you playing the Paper Trail uh, demo, uh, <laughs> and like, <laughs> there's a lot of like, like there is part of the game is like you're like doing a lot of like folding the corners, just trying to see what you can even join up. Um, and I would say that if you play it a bit long, because I played quite a bit of the game, like most of it, um, you end up getting used to like a process of understanding what's on the other side of the paper and where you need to fold things. Like a real, like a, a thing that ended up being common for me is I'd like intentionally walk to a, as far into a corner as I could and then pull the corner all the way over just to see if I could. And, and then just like remember like, oh, in this corner there's this thing, which I clearly need to use for some reason. And in this corner there's this thing that I clearly need to use for some reason. But like at the beginning of Paper, tra uh, paper Trail, it's like a little, it feels a little bit fiddly because you like you feel like you only have eight choices which you do but <laughs> uh, it's easy to I don't know still not find the thing you're looking for right so I, I so I'm actually kind of surprised because like maybe maybe this isn't like in the demo yet but like I think a feature of being able to see the other side of the paper is coming Maybe they just haven't updated the demo with that feature. Um, but yeah, that would definitely make it easier as well. Okay, let's look at here. Oh, also, hey cheese. Okay, guess he didn't say hello. Frog? Frog. Uh, <laughs> okay, so in this game, I'm drifting around, eating flies. Uh, and the flies do move out of the way, so they're not like, they don't obstruct my position. Um, but if I want to eat them, I have to quite step back. 
because I can't turn on the spot. Who watches? Yeah, like I'm really interested in who watches. Like, I've always like found dungeon crawlers like an interesting kind of aesthetic um, and like something something maze-like about them. It's really interesting. Um, but I've always just got the sense that they're often just kind of sprawling. It's just about like, oh, you find a key here and you open a door over here. And I like the idea of like a kind of dungeon crawl aesthetic with uh, very puzzly things going on. Okay, so this is where we learn. I, I love the way this is presented in the controls at the bottom. Like, they could just say, hold space and and arrow keys and just let you try and figure out what it's going to be, but they're actually going like, no, look, it's a little illustration of what we're talking about. Um, so we can stick our tongue onto the rock and stretch it out. No can reach further. Uh, we're still telling us, so we don't forget. Okay, so stretch. And we've got like, one of the flies is extra far away, so we'll stretch even further. See. Uh, I saw you playing Remote Planets as well, which um, I've played a, a bunch of for playtesting purposes as well. Not, actually, I think I only play, really played the demo um, for playtesting. Um, but I really like the game and I, I want to do a full playthrough of it, so why do I fit it in with all the other games? Because <laughs> I also want to get to Bonfire, the Bonfire Peaks DLC as well. So the tongue starts small you have to mechanically, exactly, so... Um, it starts off only one distance, like, it doesn't matter how long I hold space. It's only one square, so I can't reach the flies at the moment. So if you stretch out though, I'm adding one to the tongue, and we jump. Uh, so I want to extend out to you, which is very far. So I guess I want to stretch here, and then stretch over here to get to four. There we go. Right here. Delicious. Okay, so I've got a bunch of flies. Uh, like I said, I have played this before. I, th I think I finished it, um, but it's, it's been a while. So, okay, how do I start eating these? Uh, I guess I could at the very least eat you. I might need to start stretching immediately. Okay. Get, get you. Is there another one I could get with? Oh, I mean, I could get you easily. Uh, I guess for the... I Wait, how would I have got this one? How would I have got that one? Okay, I'll figure that out afterwards, because I can do that. Actually, that doesn't help. Let's get you. Okay, so I need to be able to step into a place facing the right direction. Can I like step back? Okay, I can do that. Okay, cool. Okay, I can pull away from the thing and do the same over here. Neat. That's nice. Steven Sausage Roll. Have you not played Steven Sausage Roll yet? Classic. Pictopole. Yep. Yeah. Rope Planets. Uh, Lingo, I've heard lots of good stuff about. I don't really know too much about it. I think it's like got word puzzly things, although I think they're more. Not really word puzzles, but like lateral thinking type of things, I think. The Golem, okay, be prepared. It's tough. It's really good. But it's, it's, it's tough <laughs> as well. Like, I've been playing Elephant recently, and Elephant and the Golem are like similar levels of difficulty. Um, yeah, you should definitely play Steam Sausage Roll. It's fantastic. Uh, what am I doing with this? How do these work? Uh, oh, I can pull myself along with my tongue. Okay, cool. Also, I apologize. Like, like most people say, like tongue, but I say tongue. <laughs> Guess it depends where you're from. Well, what do Americans say? Maybe, maybe I say it the American way. But it's not. It's not an American thing. It's like a Midlands thing. It's tongue for me, not tongue. Uh. Anytime I say tong to my friends, they just they just make fun of me for saying it like that. Uh, okay, what do we do? So stretch over here. Oh no, I can't. Can I can I pull away? No. 
if I could stretch my tongue with this and then do this, look at that, cool. Tongue in the US, okay. That's weird, it's spelt T O N. <laughs> it's spelt tongue you. Okay, I've got to eat you. Okay, so I'm probably taking that over there. So I want to stretch my tongue like that much and do that. Oh, don't do that. I still can't reach that. Oh, I can reach. Okay, there we go. <laughs> We're now learning undoing redo. How often does a game have redo? Oh, I forgot to jump over rocks. <laughs> I might be suggesting that. It's so weird, right? It never happens. Wait, so... But Q and E aren't doing anything. Is it only like after do having some effect on the world? Uh, uh, where am I going? What can I even do right now? I don't... Oh, I can stretch my tongue here and do this. So then if I... Okay. It's only if I have an effect on the world. <laughs> I do always think, like, like I often play, like, circle my games where while I'm thinking about something or what, or if I'm getting a bit, like, lost, I'll, like, tap a lot of keys. And I always wonder if it would be interesting to detect when you're just... I mean, you could do something like this where there's, like, certain actions that actually modify the state of the world in some meaningful way that isn't just your place, your character's position. And so you, you put those on the, the undo stack. But what if you also did a thing where like, oh, if you loop back around to the same state within some short period of time, it doesn't, it doesn't add that. It might feel weird. So like, it might be surprising what happens when you press undo. And that's probably what would happen, but I still think that would be interesting. Okay, uh, so let's get, which one do I want to get first? Maybe the one over there, but I'd have to also stretch my tongue. Uh, oh. Okay, so if I get over to that rock over there, I'll be able to stretch to three. No, I won't. It'll be too long. Uh, actually, okay. Ooh. Uh, I'm just going around in circles. Hold on. So two distance won't grab that. So I need to be three to even get over there, right? But that's the same for going left as well. How do I get a three distance here? Ah, by being... Like here. No, that's also two. Where do I get three from? Wait, no, that's 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 what I want. That is that is what I want. Uh, except I can't turn. So cycle round to here. Uh, keep going. Ah, do this. Okay, cool. I find it a little bit. Weird, like I guess because my to my tongue's only going over two spaces and hitting the rock, it makes me visualize the 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 distance weirdly. Another one gets let me undo through a reset. I mean, yeah, undo through a reset should be an absolute like should be in every single any single game. Every single game that has reset and undo should have undo through reset. Um, there, there is an argument that it's like slightly difficult to discover for. For people who haven't like been immersed in the space, like it's not the most intuitive thing, but you would be able to undo a reset. Like, I think intuitively people think that that would like, clear everything that you've done, rather than this like new model of like actually a restart is adding adding a cleared state to your undo stack. It's a little bit weird, but yeah, it should definitely always exist. <laughs> Also, look, bird eggs in the corner. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight eggs. There have been eight eggs for a few days, so I'm pretty sure that is, that's why we're stopping with the eggs. Wait, is this one platform? I think this might be one platform. Yes. So, oh, it's super weird that the undo is Q here instead of Z. Make a lot of random inputs in a short amount of time. The character runs around in circles with a cloud like a cartoon and it gets time to stop matching. Wait, in this game? Oh, are you, are you suggesting that that could be a thing that happens? I think there's a delivery for me. Give me one moment.
the parcel. What is it? Who knows, I'll find out later. Uh, okay. Remember what I was saying earlier, right, yeah, yeah. So many baby birds to come, indeed. Although I, I do have to warn everybody that it can be a little... Um, like the survival rate is not amazingly high. Uh, so, but that's part of, it's part of nature and that's just how it is. Uh, what am I doing? I'm just like running around without a plan. When I say running around, I'm not sure there is a verb for what I'm doing. <laughs> uh, I think I'm good though, I think you. Cool. Uh, all right, so we're on the platform of three here. I want to get to you. Let's focus on these two first. What can I even do to sort of like stretch a little bit? Uh, well, okay, I can grab you to begin with. This, this, this is the same amount of stretch. Oh, but this is a further stretch. Oh, but that pulls it that way. I could slide over. Oh yeah, that works for you. I can now stretch further. Do I want to? Does that is that enough to grab you? No, one more. Oh, which I can... No, I can't do because this will pull me upwards. Uh, I'm probably using that one. There we go. And then going around again. Uh, here. Down. Yay! So what was the suggestion? You make a lot of random inputs in a short amount of time. Catch runs in circles in the cloud like a cartoon, right? And <laughs> just gets dizzy. <laughs> I I think the thing that does come up for me is like I'll press like left, right, left, right, left, right when I'm like a little bit frustrated or like a bit stuck or whatever, and then I'll press undo, just wanting it to undo the thing before the left, right. So maybe you could detect that and just get rid of that from the undo step. But obviously in a game like this where it's only undoing the meaningful changes that's not really relevant. Uh, okay. The silly frog can't turn on the spot. So to grab you, I probably want to drag this to the left. Let's just like start stretching stuff out if I can. Oh, where, where can I even do it? I guess I can do it over there. It's got a slightly longer tongue. I could pull this over that way now. Which, oh, it doesn't let me eat that because I jump over the water. How would I eat that? Oh, can I just jump over the rock? Yep, cool. Then... I think I'm going to have to do it from here, right? So two more? Really? That's one more. Is it possible to make a path with... Oh, yeah, 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 like this. Cool. Cool. Neat. <clears throat> what time is it? When does the Thinky Game stream start? 25 minutes, okay. Like, I'm wondering if at any point is it going to be a bad thing to have stretched my tongue. Like, so far it's always been like, just, just do that. <laughs> it's always beneficial. Uh, okay, eating you. Well, oof, you're one away. But I could stretch that far here, right? Oh no, this would be a long. Hey, look what's happening in the bird box. Exciting. She's rolling her eggs around and then there we go, there we go. Isn't that fun? The way she like wiggles. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh what was I doing? <laughs> 
So I've already stretched that far. That is basically three spaces away. That fly at the bottom is always going to be four spaces away, so I will need to go further at some point, which I think I'll do here, right? Grab that rock, stretch down, which would require moving this over. Like, is, th is this fly easy to get? Not really. Oh, I can slide them like that, that's interesting. Okay, so now I can do this. Mm -hmm. Uh, which still isn't enough, but I can, it is from here. Cool. What about the other one? Was I in a position to be able to do that from here? Uh, yes, trip of the rough. Cool. Neat. What level are we on? Does it say? Does it say under the birds? Uh, one. Is that? Oh, that's tongue length. Yeah, okay. Uh, what's the F? Is that all that's to do with full screen? Okay. Uh, that just minimizes. Okay. I don't think I know which level I'm on. What did it say at the start? Part of the streams on Twitch, it has an additional webcam watching one of our guinea pig enclosures with three guinea pigs in there. Very cute. It's, it's the thing to do. Have an animal stream at the same time while you're playing a game full of animals. Okay, so we've got these two platforms. I can start stretching over here if I want to. I can stretch even further over here. So I could start sailing around. Is this sailing? Um, okay, now I can stretch even further on this bit and get here. Cool. That's good for you. An extra one? I guess so, because I'm never going to stand there. Yeah, I'm never going to stand further to the left. So, where could, so that so that was basically pulling on the rocks on the edge to the furthest side of the water. So I need to find a place where I can do that. Okay, here. Okay, got it, got it, got it. So that. But I also, ooh, okay. Yes, yes. <laughs> Sometimes I do things slightly accidentally, but it's, it's working out. Ah. That's fine. That, that's not fine. There we go. It could theoretically be a situation where you need to eat a fly when you're on a lily pad, but if your tongue's too long, you snag a rock. Interesting. As in it would like go past the fly and hit the rock. Wouldn't you think it would grab the fly first? I'm not sure if that would lead to any interesting puzzles. It's just kind of a, a rude sequencing gotcha. <laughs> Yeah, possibly. Uh, okay, it's a stretch. This is a very small level. This is going to teach me something, right? This is one of those... I know this is going to show me something weird levels. Oh, oh, it's showing me rocks on on lily pads. Okay. It's like pull things towards me. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what it would do in that case. Uh, okay, you. Okay, so I can grab rocks on lily pads bring it towards me. I guess I want to set up a situation cute or new, where I'm like, I think I'm going to want to stretch here, right? Therefore I'd have to be over there. How's that going to work? I can get on you. Oh, I can pull it back towards me. This is nice. This is lovely. Okay, cool. Back, back, back. Yep. Pull this way. Hey. Uh, can I get any of these just by default? I don't think so. Let's stretch first. Let's just stretch it. Stretch my tongue a little bit. Uh, so I think, like, by having it close to me, that lets me. Yeah, I can get you. So, like, moving it away from a fly makes it easier to get the fly. Uh, so this one I can get. Uh, now how do I pull it to the left? I pull this down, but I can't, right? Oh, no I can, I can. Of course I can. Yep. Cool. Neat. Uh, 
So it's a similar set. Well, these are separate, aren't they? Why is one darker than the other? I guess maybe just to distinguish the two platforms. Uh, so let's stretch first. Let's find somewhere where we can stretch. Um, <laughs> I, was, I found a place to stretch, but it required to be able to bring the lily pads over. Uh, so I need a place where I can do that without pulling any lily pads, I think. There's, oh, there's a place here, of course. There we go. And that might be enough to at the very least grab you. The other one I could get if I were... Hmm. Like, like, I could do it from here if the rock weren't there. <laughs> Also, I can't do it from there because I can't turn around. That's part of every puzzle of finding the initial stretch spot, exactly. <laughs> so to grab you, I need a space where I turned around and I can reach at least two. I mean, I could be stretching further. Ah, so okay, I have an idea then. Maybe we are pulling these things back over. I'm putting you up at the top so I can stretch from here. Oh yeah, okay, there's a fly that looks very big because I'm already... Oh, there's a rock in its place, I think. Okay, stretch. That's to stretch somewhere, anywhere, it doesn't matter where. Um... Oh gosh. Oh, I can jump this way. Okay, that's you. Get one out of the way. I, I can't get you. So you're you're where that rock is. So let's get that rock out of the way, I guess. Can I even get there? No, not really. So let's get here and do this. All right. <clears throat> then if I could get back down there, which I don't know if I can. I can, I can. There you go. Now you. So we need to stretch. I would have been able to do it in the previous position. I can do it now. Okay. Stretch one more. Get down there. Eat. Delicious. It needs a thing that comes up at the end to saying delicious. Delicious. <laughs> okay, these flies are far away. How am I gonna eat these flies? This is stretch. You just did the thing and it did indeed eat the fly and grab the rock behind it. Did I? Interesting. <laughs> I didn't even think about it when I was doing it. I did the thing where I grabbed a rock that was under a fly. Yeah, but maybe, maybe I did. I like the little ripples in the water when you drop on a leaf pad. That's nice. Okay, we need to... I mean, I could stretch even further, right? Like, yeah. I can stretch real far. Let's start moving these around in some way. That kind of feels bad, doesn't it? Do this and bring you this way. Uh, which I think gets that one. Yep. And to get the other one, we'd want to... Yeah, okay. Bring... Can we reach that? We can. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't sure how long my tongue was. And then with this one, I think we can grab the last four. Yeah. Cool. Only one fly. I'm actually th thinking now, maybe I haven't played all of this game before. I don't know, it was a while ago. When did it come out? Must have been like, three years ago, four years ago? Okay, so this is just about finding a place where we can grab you. And you're blocked on the left, we're not going to be on your right, so it's from above. Uh, how much can I stretch right now? Like, basically as much as I have. Um, so finding other opportunities to stretch would be good. 
Okay, I'll remember the last level if I played it. Interesting. Is is this the last level? Well, I don't know what the last level is. <laughs> I don't remember this one at least. Um, okay, what can I do to begin with? I gotta start moving some things around. Uh, I guess I can move you this way. I'm not sure where that's leading me. Leading me to bad situations. Just looking for rocks that I can grab or stretch on or anything. I can't reach you. That might have been bad. Let's, re let's restart. If I, if I could get a slightly longer tongue, I could do some stuff. Uh. Okay, I could I could stretch you that way instead. Is that positive? Does that have a positive effect? That way. Yeah, then I can grab you. This feels like it's a bit more productive. Then I can stretch a bit further on that rock. Cool. Neat. So what's my leg now? Three away. I'm sure I can do something, I just can't see what. Uh, I mean, maybe we move back up and then start stretching this around in a different way. That's too far. I could bring you all the way this way now. Bring you up. I don't really know where I'm heading. Oh, I mean, I could bring that one down. That's interesting. I like that I can walk all the way around this outside. So I can bring you down. I can bring you down, but isn't that just necessarily worse? Except unless I move it to the left at some point. Which I might be. Look at my th am I going to be stretching that far somehow? Grab, I, okay, if we go all the way around, I can drag that one down, can I? I think that's the right distance, yeah. And I can pull this that way. <laughs> then if I could, like, get the square platform over to the right, which I can't in this situation. I just, I keep feeling like, oh, I probably missed a moment where I could have stretched a bit further. Can't reach that. Uh, <laughs> grab that, but can't do anything with it. Okay, we need a good stretchy time. We need a good stretchy time. What's going to happen? Not here. Move that back again. Is there no move I can do at this point? I mean, I could move things back up, I guess. Struggling to see how that would be useful. I guess, so both of these platforms, this one and the one below me, have a rock that would be on their rightmost edge. And so does this, but it has a space below the rock. So it does feel like I'm gonna be on this, eating that fly. However, how? This game could have dead ends in it, right? I think so. Everything's not reversible. How did I pull that down in the first place? Or is it now not possible? I guess by having been on that other one, I think I'm getting into a dead end. So what if I, I haven't lifted that one up? 
but instead I have just gone around here and grabbed you. And then I brought that one down again. But how did I do that? Oh, from uh, from there. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. Then we can do this that way. Then we get this one out of the way and bring that one to the right, but I wouldn't be able to get it past. Unless I can, because it could go up. Ooh. Ah, no, not that. Um. Okay, actually, don't take you left. Take this up. Take that down. No, 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 no. Alternatively, bring that one this way. If I move that one over at the top, the L-shaped one to the left again, and then can I start getting these two around each other? Oh gosh, that's not what I want. I might have been closer before. Also, I'm realizing right now if. Like, that I might be losing track of, like, what I'm even trying to do, which is eat that fly. And I, I might have been going through states where I'm, I've actually been able to. I don't think I have, though. I'm not in that state right now. Um, I can't pull that platform north, right? The, the, the little one. It's too far. I actually want to do. I want to do this again. I want to do this. I want to do this. Problem is now I can't get onto that platform. I think that's a problem. Can here, but nowhere else. Like what I'm thinking is that this would go like up and to the right. I don't see a way that can happen. I can pull it to the right a little bit. Oh, no, not like that. The problem is I can't get on this, so I can't pull that to the right. Unless I can jump to that from here, which I can't. So that's why I went back and was like, what if I try and move this to the right? while wow, that's in that position. Not like that though, like this. And then try and move this up. <laughs> I always try and like move a platform up. I'm thinking about how it works in my uh, Elastic Fantastic game. Okay, this feels good. Although does it, how will this ever go left? Maybe if I can get this down? Okay, actually, maybe we could start... I was about to do it again. But, um, oh no, no, that, that does the right thing. <laughs> I now just flipped over how it works in my head. Uh, it pulls the thing far away from me towards me. My frog feet are stickier than my tongue. Um, but now what am I going to do? Now we're all stuck together. So that's not good, actually, is it? Or, oh, hold on. Da, 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 da. Let's lift this one back up, which I can do, right? No, I can't. Is this somewhere I could have stretched at some point? This is the same distance. Yeah. Oh, hold on, hold on, can I stretch there? Oh, I can easily stretch there. Uh, redo. Stretch. Oh, no, I can't because it pulls there. <laughs> hmm. It's hard to stretch while on the lily pads because they'll just move.
how to progress from here. Oh gosh, that was a weird move. But everything moved. That actually might be good though. So that could come here. However, I need, a, I need a way to move this rightwards. Which might be doable actually. Okay, this. Move. This is gonna move up, is it? It's gonna move that down. <laughs> Can I get this to the right? Mm, yes. Then move. Where are we going with this? It's also not going to go up because now I can't reach a thing. Move this both to the left? It's almost time for the big game stream. Uh, so we'll stop in a second, but maybe we'll get this now. That's not how that works. And this is going to bring that down to me instead of bringing this up to that. So to bring this up, I'd have to get that one back down. When was that down? Okay. And how did I move? Oh, I did. No. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So this is go up like this and drag you this way. And do this. Then get this out to the left. Take this north. Can I now get... I can't get onto that, can I? Oh, I can, I can. Right over here. I think we got it. Ah, wait. <laughs> no. Is there a quick way to fix this? Oh, uh... No, this doesn't help. That makes things worse. I want to land there, but there's, there's, there's a rock in the way. Uh, what if I got further north? What if I just, like, got these out of the way? Well, can I? I don't think I can... like doing the opposite of what I want. <laughs> exactly. Uh, I think I'm going to stop because it's time for the Thinking Game stream. So uh, everybody should head, head over to twitch.tv slash thinkygames. No space, no one score, just slash thinkygames. And go watch Joel play some, some games from the Puzzle Fest, I believe. All right. Thanks for watching. We'll, we'll maybe continue this at some point. Uh, I don't know how close to the end I am. I've also got to get back to Gestalt OS as well, which was also in the Thinky Games Club. Um, oh yeah, and if you're not if you're not like subscribed to the Thinky Games newsletter, you should subscribe to that. That's why this game has come up because it was in the newsletter. Like every two weeks, we send out a newsletter with a game in it to play, and this was the one in the most recent one. Uh, all right, cool. Thanks for watching, folks. See you in the chat for the Thinky Games stream. Twitch.tv/slash Thinky Games. Goodbye.